Hello YouTube. I found this guitar on Ricardo, which is a Swiss equivalent to eBay and I thought I'd give it a go. As I don't know very much about guitars, especially old guitars, I make this YouTube video to document it. Maybe someone can tell me more about this guitar. I believe everything is original, which makes it quite interesting. It should be possible to identify the guitar based on the video. On the guitar I did not find any information helping to identify the model. There's a Höfner decoy on the headstock and a small engraving made in Germany on the tailpiece, but there's no serial number. I found the scanned Höfner catalog from 1967 online. The second guitar from the left seems to be this model. There's also some information, including the American retail price. The pickguard is obviously missing. There are the holes from the installation on the body, on the fretboard and on the bridge. The bridge is plastic. It could be original from the time. Höfner did things like that. The guitar is in well used but still beautiful shape. The wood is beautiful, flamed maple back and sides. I'm going to replace the bridge. I'm going to clean the guitar. I intend to use it myself, playing mostly acoustically. Obviously I have to replace the strings, they are really corroded, rusty and well used. The truss rod cover covers part of the decoy. This is original as it is visible in the catalogue picture as well. It is a five piece neck. It is quite bulky. Now I finally understand what they mean when they are talking about baseball bat necks. There are some dings and dongs on the body, some scratches from the previous owner who certainly used this guitar quite a lot. The tuners work, too bad one of the knobs is broken. For the moment I'm not going to replace it. But the bridge is annoying. Here you can see that the string spacing of the bridge pickup does not match the pole pieces. This is the replacement bridge which I'm going to install right away. As new strings I selected tens flat wound, but I think they are too thin. Probably I'm going to replace those again with a heavier string gorge. I had a look at the pickups. I hope to see some marking underneath, but I only found a small print on the bridge pickup that was not readable. The pickups are still available today. I found them on the Thurman website as Höfner pickups used from 1963 to 1967. I took a couple of pictures from the inside of the guitar, hoping to find a date or some other marking, but there's nothing visible. The truss rod looks pretty well to me. So now I'm going to replace the bridge, sand the new bridge down to match the curvature of the arch top. I use sandpaper and a newspaper to protect the finish.
The new bridge is much wider than the old one, but it fits quite well. Thank you for watching. If you have additional information on this guitar, please leave a comment. Thank you.